What up, Pokemon peeps? How are ya? Yes, I know it's been like two weeks, but each video I've done, like, haunted wise, I didn't like, and then there was one I couldn't do because I didn't realize until I started looking back on everything and get the resources I needed to, um, show you guys the uh, articles I couldn't use, so I'm like, alright, I'm not gonna use it, I'm gonna try it. I'm just didn't work. So anyway, long story short, I'm going to come at you with a different type of story right now. Oh my god. This this is literally hilarious. But dope. And serves as a warning to a lot of people. I guess you can say. Anyway, this is about my online dating relationship story. This one in particular stands out, so I'm going to jump around on it, so forgive me. This happened about 2013. I was living on my own, in my very own apartment. I didn't really have a laptop then. I had just a little phone. That's all I had. That worked. So anyway, I went on a dating site called datinghookup.com, and I realized now that, well... I did so realize that then that it's a hookup site. You, you get my drift. Um. So anyway, I met a couple of different guys. You know, I was talking to them. All right, and I was leading the weird ones out and whatever. And I met this point. I'm like, okay, this guy is all right. So I started messaging, we started messaging back and forth on the site. Then moved up to texting and then we called. Um, I'd say up all night talking to him and tell him this and that and the other thing and he'd tell me all this crap. And I'm like, okay. So the relation relationship progressed and then he's like, oh, I'll come down this day and visit you for like a week or something. I'm like, okay, that's cool. Um, and one day he called me frantic or freaking all over something. Like, he saw his ex and he wasn't, I don't rightly remember, but it was dumb and he's stupid. But then again, consider your source. Anyway, um, he's like, oh, I gotta get out of here. I'm on my way to see you now. I'm like, okay, whatever. So, and he was being a little prick, a little bit more prickish than should be allowed. My hair is old. Ugh. So, anyway. Um. I'm, if you know me at all, I'm not the, I am the absolute worst at giving directions. Like, I cannot drag my way out of a, oh, sorry, out of a paper bag. <laughs> I'm that bad. So anyway, um, I'm on the phone with him, like, alright, I gotta get some sleep, you know, I'm tired. So, he figures it out, um, and I'm like, okay, go down and meet him in the parking lot and come up, fall asleep, wake up, and then everything's fine, everything's okay. Goes on for maybe a week or a eh, few days or so. And I'm like, okay, I don't want to cook, so I'll just order pizza. So anyway, I um, ordered pizza, and I walked down to the gas station. And first thing is, well, one of many red signs is he did not have a toothbrush. I'm like, are you serious? And dude had like maybe three, three four teeth in his mouth, maybe. And it's like, dude, I'll get you a toothbrush. They're cheap enough, I'll get you one, no worries. So I, anyway, I get I'm halfway back from the gas station and he calls me, he's like, Oh, uh pizza guy's here, da 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 I'm like, Okay, I'll be there shortly. So I get there, pay for the pizza, give him the stuff, I'm like, here, toothbrush. <sighs> dude doesn't use it. Okay. He claims his truck is effed up. 
he's working on it. I'm like, okay. Thinking, all right, he'll just be here maybe a couple more days at the least. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Was not. He stayed for maybe two, I want to say like two weeks, two weeks, something like that. And he was a dick. Dude. And he's like, oh, my truck is shot. I got to get rid of it, whatever, sell it. So, long story short, he sold the truck to, I guess, a wrecker or something. And he was looking for a new vehicle. I'm like, okay. So, he'd look on Craigslist and all this and that. And he actually found one. And he's like, oh, I only have so much. Like, Alright, I'll help you out. Me being nice, kind. Not the smartest bulb in the bottom. Oh, my hair is not working. Anyway. Not the bar is balling off, but I thought I was helping. I was being nice. Hmm. So, anyway. He's looking for a car, car, truck, truck, whatever, and he's looking. And, mind you, he's eating me, literally, out of house and home. I'm doing laundry. Like, I'm trying to come up with change to use the washer and dryer. In a building. And it's like, really, dude? And he locked himself in the back and he went to sleep with me. I'm like, okay, whatever. He's just, whatever. So I didn't think two things of it at first. And then he'd go outside for phone calls. Because, and he'd freak out because he didn't have cigarettes and whatever. Here. So, anyway. Um. He would just start being dickish. He would show me, like, these truck videos or whatever on YouTube. And he's like, oh, look. Uh -huh. And then and I'm trying to be like, okay, let me see what I can do with Snow up. And he's like, dude, really? And he locked himself in my bathroom. Bathroom, excuse me. And it's like, dude, really? And he'd take pictures of himself, like, this big pear-headed dude. Like, mm, you know, type of thing. It's like, dude, really? And it, more and more shady started to come out. So, anyway, I go in one day and I look at my toilet seat. He broke my toilet seat. How in the world do you break a toilet seat? He did. He sat down and go, poop. You heard? Or uh, what? Sit down and go, poop or what? I don't know, but how do you break a toilet seat? So, for the time being, I'm like, alright, I'll just do this quick and we'll leave with it in a while. And, no. So, one day, so, after I told him, I said, okay, I get paid on this day and I can go to my ATM and get this much and that, that, that. He's like, okay, can you give me a pack of sugar too? I'm like, oh, yeah, I guess, you know, whatever. But, excuse me. So, anyway. I have no idea what the hell. I ended up falling asleep. He was like, oh, let's go. Good. Money. Uh, uh. I'm like, what the? I'm like, all right, fine. Whatever. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, uh, uh. And it's like, really, dude? So anyway, um, walk up to the ATM, get the money, and then went to the gas station. He's walking here. I'm walking here, you know, on one side of the road. And, you know, here's me. Yep. Here's here's me. No, actually, here's him. Here's me. Walking, 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 and he's all, "Oh, you're gonna get in trouble for doing that." Da, da, da. I'm like, "Shut up, dude. I'm fine. I'm I'm not hurting anyone. You know, I've lived here longer than you will ever will. So blah blah." So he started bitching, bitching. I'm like, "Here, he's your effing cigarettes." Da da da. So anyway, um, he got cigarettes and on the way back to my apartment, he was just bitching, bitching about any and everything. It's like, dude, shut the hell up. He's just being such a jerk to me. So anyway, that after you know a few hours, I fell back to sleep and we had to call. You know, we're trying to figure out how to get to the truck that he found that he bought. And I said I would help him. And he's all, oh, I feel like I owe you something. Like, mm -hmm. Whatever, good. 
So anyway, um, instead of taking the bus, we took a taxi. I never took a taxi before, first time. So anyway, the person was very kind, very nice. Um, and I made sure to tip, the, to tip her good because, you know. Um, so anyway, we get to the place, pay the guy for the truck, get back to the apartment. And dude starts taking all this stuff out of my apartment, like, fine, whatever, dude. I do whatever. I'm like, oh, bye, you know, I miss you, da da da. And I'm texting him after a while, I'm like, oh, I miss you, too. you know, because I thought I was in love. I wasn't. I was really lonely, and I needed something. So, anyway, he never took him back, and, you know, so finally, maybe like, oh, or something. Um, he. So anyway, I get a message on my phone, you know, a text from this person. It's like, oh, you leave him alone. This is his wife to be or whatever. I'm like, uh, he never said that. He said this and that and the other thing. And he, he's like, oh, I lied to you. <laughs> what do you think I was on the phone walking out? <laughs> I'm like, dude, really? And I wasn't hurt. I. I literally, I didn't care. But the thing that really pissed me off was that. And I was literally pissed off, dude. Like, I was pissed off. He took my money. He ate me out of the house at home. Drank all my, all my drinks, you know. And he would use all my change. And he broke my toilet seat. Which, to this day, I, you had to be going pretty hard. Or slam pretty hard down on the toilet seat to break it, or I don't know. But anyway, um, I was pissed. I was so pissed off. I was crying. I was losing my voice, and and I wasn't heartbroken. I was pissed, and he knew it. So anyway, I blocked him. I saw talked to him, and then was it last year or something like that? He oh, he can't even see me. Oh, man. Yeah. Hmm, it's too much. It's too Whoa, hello. Anyway. He just basically used me, and he is a huge douche about it. And I blocked him, and like I said, sometime later... Um, he had the cojones message me like, oh, hi, how are you doing? So, what was my response? Oh, I'm doing good. Not that you care. And I blocked him. I'm like, F you, I don't need your influence in my life. You're a piece of crap. So, that is my worst, well, one of, my worst online dating things. And, yeah. So needless to say, I never talked to him again, and he is, Karma's pretty much catching up with him from what I know, or what I'm guessing. Woo! So anyway, sorry about the darkness, maybe I'll redo this later. Ooh, wait, okay. Anyway, if you like these type of videos, I'm sorry this is so long, maybe I'll edit it down to where I can, if I know how to edit it. Anyway, if you like these type of story time videos, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you have it. If you have, and if you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Nikki. Thanks for hanging out with me and it's Grumpy Pugma over here. Who's Susan? Um, I, I'm going to try and make new videos maybe every Tuesday and every Thursday. We'll see how it goes and see how much material I have. All right, so if I skipped the that and I wasn't feeling good. So anyway, uh. If you want to get new, if you want to get notifications, press that little bell down there that's by the subscribe button. I'll let you know when I actually get off my duff and post new videos. Um, yeah, like I said, like like this video if you like these type of rambling stories, and yeah, um, I will see you next time. Like, comment, subscribe, and...
I already said that. And you can follow me on all social media. If you follow me on Snapchat and I haven't been snapping that much, it's because my phone. I'll show you. My phone does not have a front facing camera. That's been on hold for a while. So, anyway, everything else is fine. I will talk to you later. I'm sorry, this is like 16 minutes. Oh my god. Anyway, I love you guys. Bye.